All right, so this is how the packaging looks right here. A funny story, I only thought it came with the eyeliner and it actually comes with the brush and I bought a separate brush thinking that it didn't. So this is a brush that I got. Um, let me show you this one just in case you're interested in buying this one. This is how this one looks. It has two, two different brushes, but this one only has one. This is how the liner looks. The ingredients are Amazonian clay, vitamin E, mineral pigments, and botanical waterproofing agent. It says, um, inspired by the ease of an artist's palette, this revolutionary cream eyeliner features a tapered applicator with a flat blending stage to easily pick up the ideal amount of product to line and define like a pro tartiste. Cute. <laughs> to use, gently squeeze a small amount of product onto the blending stage surface and which might be that right there if you guys can see that and it basically says pick up the liner by fully coating the bristles of the included angled brush glide brush along the upper and lower lash line to create your perfect look okay so let's try this out it's open taking the little thing off of this now again this is how the brush looks i've never used a brush like this so i'm a little concerned that I might not get this down so it says squeeze a product so it comes carefully you guys have to make sure you guys do this carefully okay so I have some right there I don't know if you guys can see that so I guess coat both of the products bristles I mean It dries fairly quickly. It's actually really easy to, to do your liner with this brush. What I like to do is I basically first do this part right here. Most of the time I do this and then I just usually do my wing at the end. So that's how it looks right there I don't usually you notice that there's like a little gap right here I don't usually like to connect this together because I have a little bit of skin or a skin right here I just don't like how it looks that's why I like to do like a little curve right there okay so I think it's completely dry now And this is how intense black that looks you guys can see that it's actually really black and it's matte so I like that go ahead and do this eye so this is how it looks right here keep in mind that I do have a piece of like some sort of skin here so my liners never usually match a lot 
You can definitely clean it up and add a little bit more, but it, I noticed that if you do it too many times, you can, um, it can start, it looks like it will flake. It's a really good eyeliner. I mean, it glide on pretty easily. Um, it, I like the fact that you can actually control how much product you can take out and keep it here. The rest of it won't dry up that easily. It is really, again, like I said, it's really black and matte and um, I really do like it. And let me check the prices just to show you guys exactly how much I paid for it. It was $24 for the brush and the, the eyeliner. This one was $15 if you guys are interested in getting a bigger one with two different um, options. So if you're not used to this brush to um, apply your eyeliner, this one has a straight, if you can see right there, and then it also has this curved one, and it's longer. Um, but yeah, again, I really do recommend this product. You should give it a try if you do like matte and really black eyeliner. I hope you guys like this um, tutorial slash first impression slash review of this <laughs> new Tarte Tartiste um, clay paint liner. Let me know what you guys think if you do try it out, um, if you do end up liking the product or not. I hope you guys like this video and I will see you guys on the next one. Bye.